name is Mr. Corbin, and today's lesson focuses on mental multiplication. Students need mental skills because they will have uh, lots of calculations to do in, in many lessons requiring quick knowledge. Today we're going to look at multiplying by 50 and multiplying by 25 with speed. The first thing, uh, let's just recap. How would you have done this calculation in school? My guess, similar to this you probably wouldn't have learnt, learnt mental strategies and you would do it probably in a written style 0 times 6 0 0 times 3 0 we're multiplying here by now 50 so we need to drop in 0 5 times 6 that's 30 I've got my 3 up there and 5 times 3 is 15 add the 3 18 now if we add them together it's obvious the answer is 1,800. Let's move on to how we teach our students. Mental strategies. The first thing that we encourage them to do is say 36 times by 100. Now when we times by 100, we ask students to move the uh, digits two places to the left and insert the zeros. So you'll probably realise the answer will be 3,600. If we multiply 36 by 50, we notice that 50 is half of 100. So the answer must be half of this. Hmm. Half of 36, I know that's 18. Half of 3,600, 1,800. You can do that really, really quickly. This is my method, but I can do it in my head. Work it out, times by 100, and then halve it. Let's do the same again. Um, but by doing it by 25. Step 1, 36 times 100, 3,600. To multiply by 50, we're just going to halve it. I'm going to look at here, times by 50. And if we want to multiply by 25, we just halve it again. Half of 18, half of 1,800, 900. So very quickly, we can work out the answer. That's today's lesson, mental multiplication. Thank you.